Every year, this disease claims 500,000 victims, most of which are children. In high-risk zones, one child in five dies of malaria. We're in Madagascar. The farmers are harvesting Artemisia annua, a plant that originated in China. This plant is illegal in France. While the plant still faces scathing criticism in Europe, the southern countries have not hesitated to give it the go-ahead. Uh, we'll have to have drugs and vaccines and other things to do these eradication. Losing artemisinin would be a catastrophe for the WHO. It's a huge business. I'd like to see them with a child dying in front of them. One group of patients were treated with T and the other group with the ACTs. The T scored 99%. The products of pharmaceutical firms get a green light, while a plant that has achieved good results remains prohibited. So we ask ourselves why. Perhaps it's more profitable to have a patient who remains a client. The tea has been used in China for 2,000 years. Artemisia tea has proven to be a very positive element in our lives and our children's lives. It seems that Artemisia won't be growing in the gardens of the WHO, but it continues to flourish everywhere else. To stop seeing my African brothers dying, we can cure our brothers using plants that can be grown right here.